Allergic asthma occurs when your immune system overreacts to things in the environment. And very often these things in the environment are pretty much harmless substances. They can include things like dust, mold, pollens from grasses, trees, weeds, things that are all around your area but can be possibly things that are triggering your asthma symptoms. The allergist is going to do several things. The first thing they're going to do is they're going to take a full history in terms of all of your symptoms and any other complicating problems that may be affecting your symptoms. In addition, the patient is going to have a physical exam, which you would expect if you go to a doctor. And mostly, and, and I think very, very importantly, there's going to be an investigation of what the allergy triggers are, and that may involve doing allergy tests and also checking for any complicating factors such as a sinus problem or nasal problems that could be affecting your allergic asthma. Then it's time to get treated. And the treatment very often involves using inhalers on a regular basis, what we call anti-inflammatory inhalers, or maybe even using medicines called biologics that are given by injection. And also, very, very importantly, is to do things to try and avoid the things you're allergic to. If it is a severe allergy that you can't avoid all the things that you're allergic to, then the doctor may prescribe immunotherapy, or what we call allergy shots. And immunotherapy is a way of desensitizing. You're making you less sensitive to the things that you're allergic to. And hopefully with immunotherapy, your allergic responses will decrease and your allergic asthma will improve dramatically. <music>